Sometimes good things come to those who wait. Other times they happen because you realize an opportunity was within grasp and you chased after it. Some people say the water's calmer on the other side. Frankly, we don't care as long as it's frozen. Yeah. Okay. Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yeah, is he coming up? Yeah. Yeah. I'm trying to currently setting up the yes, 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 yes. I'll get the train juice out for you. Yes. Cooper. Oh, didn't even set up the shack yet. Okay. Yeah, so we'll take it. We'll take it. Okay. Wow, that is one white crappie. That is a white crappie. Kind of ugly. <laughs> <laughs> it's our fish, Charlie. That's our fish. Oh. Thank you, buddy. Here we go. Okay. You're so excited. You did, you're like, oh, there's fish out there. I'm not even gonna pull, pull out my. There's a fish. Huh? There's a fish. Really? Yep. Yes, 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 yes. yes. Oh, we're still setting up. We barely been to this spot and we already got our second fish. This is so cool. Holy damn. Oh, get that crappie. Oh, 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 oh. Yes. <laughs> Nicely done. Thank yes. you. Yes. Let's go. Wow. Right in the top of the lip. That is a bulky crappie. Oh, there we go, about 11 inch crappie, 11 and a half. So, just got him on a plastic. We just got out here, aren't even set up. We're gonna get on some more. Let's let him back. We got another one? Yep. Oh, yes. Yes, 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 yes. We got a crappie, really nice crappie actually. I cannot complain about catching a few of these today. Like, it's gonna be awesome. Oh yeah. There's another one. That's the plan. My goodness. Save some for me, man. <laughs> I haven't started fishing yet. <laughs> He's gonna fish it all out before I even get anything. Ooh, this one's better. <laughs> yeah. Well, this yeah. has yeah. more of a fight. They're just like cookie cutters, and there's just so many of them down there. There we go. There's another one. Woo! <laughs> if I can't catch them while I'm setting up, I'm at least gonna be in the video. Camera two. Mm -hmm. Another one. Wow, really? Yep. Woo! Gotta get down there. I gotta get my camera gear set up though. Got nothing. There we go. Another crappie. Wow. Nicely done. Thank you. Got him. Number five? Nope. All right, man. Ooh. There you go. And an ornament crappie. Good. For now. Yeah. Oh my word. That thing came up so fast. Oh. Cool. You're just slaying them, man. Yeah, I just found that plastic. Hello, mighty walker. It rocks. Welcome back to Espros, guys. We have been waiting and waiting and waiting, waiting for ice. Waiting. And ice almost formed in our area and, and then it melted. It totally melted. So you know what we did? We drove three hours north. We're here. We paid good money. We were nervous. I at least I was nervous. I yeah. was really nervous that we were gonna get to the bays and find that we could barely even walk the bays. We're finding four to eight inches of ice anywhere we go on this lake. It's so. like this lake here, I'll give you like spin around here. This lake is not a small lake, but it's also not like a huge lake. 
lakes. 900 so. and some odd acres, I think. Yeah, it was like 900 acres. 1,000, 2,000, somewhere in there. Somewhere, <laughs> just in that general somewhere area. Somewhere in Eagle River, you know, one of the 1,000 lakes that's here. But I have high hopes. I think we're gonna catch some big fish, or yeah. at least abundance of fish. There's another one. There we go. Another crappie. Right in real. They, oh, ho, 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 the sneaky little buggers are there. They must be the tiny little crappies. Or the smart or big the ones. Or the smart big one. Wanna play with it? There we go. I let him play with it like four times because I was sick of that happening. What are we? What? Oh! Huh. Must we have a school of bluegills down there? Look at that. I'm holding it way out with my arm, super far out to make me feel um, less insuperior. Insuperior? Insuperior? Insuperior next to my brother Joshua. Alright. Bye bye, little fishy. Swim. Go for B3. Bottom one's the most interesting. You got him? Yep. Alright. What, what is he? Another bluegill? Does he got a school of bluegills? Yep. Another bluegill. That's a nice bluegill, though. Six inch bluegill. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> hey, that is your home. You live down there. Coming off bottom, one coming off bottom, and he's on it. He's on it. Give it the two tap. There's another one. Nice. This is like the hottest crappie bite I think I have. I've never seen one like this. Yeah, this is insane. The only time I've seen this is like in the summertime if you get like a spawn. Holy, Holy crap. crap! Wow! No, that's a crappie. That's why we came out here. He might be 11 and a half, 12, but he's a slab. Holy cow! Like, that's worth pulling that camera out for. Oh my word, but this crappie's huge. Look at this thing. Wow. Just the belly on that. No way. There's no even fish on my locator. Wow. I bet you it's a bluegill, I'm calling it. Wow. That's a nice crappie, brother. Thank you. That's not a bluegill, by the way. <laughs> oh, really? Got a tap. That was a tiny little tap. Oh, yep, 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 yep. There we go. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Ooh. There we go. My first good crappie. Okay, so I'm gonna see what else we can catch. Probably more crappie. <laughs> Woo! Don't you wish you were fishing? Well, you're not. That's why you're watching us. Yeah. You're welcome. Or maybe they are fishing and watching us at the same oh, time. Oh, that would Maybe be really better. Cool. So that's a diehard fisherman right there. We're gonna find out. It's worth it. If there's a fish on bottom, that's something cool. Man, if I caught the walleye, that would be cool. You don't have a fish. Yep. No. Uh. Yep. On your minnow? Yep. Wow. Nice fish, man. Thank you. Another nice slab. Yeah. Ah, oh, my goodness. Now it's gonna smell like burnt water again. Ooh, there's a fish. Yeah? Yup. On? Yeah. Oh, you're catching one? Yeah. All oh, right. Well, the trick is just when we stop fishing. They're like, oh, Charlie's done. No, no. <laughs> He's like, it's warm in here. <laughs> he seriously didn't want to go down. Did you see that? Yeah, I did. If you can't catch fish, go to Walmart to buy chicken. So this is our favorite time of year, reason being is because of ice fishing. Whether you're talking jigging, casting, bass fishing, pike fishing, definitely prefer ice fishing above all. There's just something super cool about coming out on that hard water and walking out there and just knowing that there's fish under your feet. Like just being able to walk as far as you can see and there's just something about it. As you're walking out there, as the icicles form on your beard, knowing that you're just two feet away from possibly stepping in that shelter because you walked so far and you unzip that shelter and you're like, I made it. I'm here. Where's the fish? And then you catch that fish. And you do catch that fish. And then you catch another fish and, and then another, another fish. fish. And another I sit fish. over here and I'm like, I'm not catching nothing. Where's my fish? 
and then all of a sudden it happens for me and I'm like wow that's the greatest five inch crappie I've had in my entire life wow oh I'm getting hit hey hello hello Woo! yeah Woohoo! this is he's pretty oh wow Ooh, that's a nice crappie right there, sir. That is a nice crappie. That's a nice little slab. Just nice crappies like that. Super healthy, too. They're super healthy. They're fat. You can tell they get a lot of food. I don't think much pressure at all. We're going to let him go. Thanks for playing, little buddy. Hey, apparently he likes the warmth. Hey, you ruined my heater. <laughs> we know that you care. So Bogle. Bogle. <laughs> Bogle. This is all God. for you, Bogle. You had an awesome morning this morning. I did. It was just non-stop 11, 11 and a half inch crappie. So I was setting up the shelter. First, we, what we did was we were like, okay, we want to go crappie fishing because walleye fishing didn't look too promising when we were scouting it. So we're like, okay, well, we got to kind of change up our game plan. So we found a nice deep hole. So then we drilled holes on all the edges of this deep hole that we found. We drilled more holes around more holes. <laughs> So then we dropped the locator down and we're like, okay, eh, that spot didn't look great. The next one looks fine. But then this one, it's like, holy cow, Joshua, there's just marks everywhere. Everywhere. And I was like, oh, we can't waste time setting up, but we got to set up because it's cold out here. Joshua, sit down and start pounding them. And that's what we did. And <laughs> that's what you did. <laughs> so most of the footage you saw was from that. It was actually on just a tungsten jig with the plastic. Actually, that's how aggressive they were. It wasn't even like live bait. It was using plastics. You said it's one of your favorite plastics, though. Yeah, that's true. It's uh, the Northland Skeleton Minnow. They're really hard to find. If you can find them, they're really, really, really You funny. ready for the Christmas giveaway? Not really, but why not? Should we fix that? Sure, why not? All right, we're doing the Christmas giveaway. Let's fix that. There we go. Def Much better. I Definitely. feel way more festival. I don't know <laughs> festival. <laughs> they're like a food store. I feel way more festive. How about you? Yeah, definitely. Like, yeah. Almost too much. So Jesus is the reason for the season. For We're sure. celebrating that by celebrating the ice fishing season and giving you guys something from that season, the ice fishing season. So let's get to the giveaway. All right, tell them the rules. So basically to enter this giveaway, it is really simple. All you have to do is comment down below who has a better Christmas sweater. Obviously like, like, um, this guy right I, here. I'm sorry for that, but comment down below who has a better Christmas sweater, aka right. it's gonna be me. Just before, I gotta pull out the big guns. Oh, Check that out. Okay. My, mine doesn't have anything Christmas. on the back, but mine does have like, there you go. Find a better Christmas sweater. Let, Let me, me know. know. I'm gonna start you off. Everything's Christmas related. See this Everything. beautiful, beautiful. Swedish pimple? It's green and red. Yes. That could be yours. All right, if you comment put down below who has a better Christmas sweater. Yeah, all right, yes. next. Next, we have this 13 Fishing Magic Man. It is like a lipless crankbait. I don't know if you can see that real well, but definitely could catch some fish. Another Magic Man, it's so cool. It's silver and red. That one's Notice the theme. Hmm? Definitely a different it's color. upside down, or is it upside no, down? No, it's the right way. Yeah, all right, so there's that. And then, last but not least, we have some green advanced suffix line. Since it is Christmas, it is green. So there you are. And this is in four pound tests. It's a cold polymer, basically just a mix between fluorocarbon and monofilament. It will definitely do you good out on the ice. The curry forgot to take that off the table. Yeah, we did, uh, unfortunately. You guys can win this if you get us to 100,000 subscribers on Christmas time by, by whenever. I don't care. You can have one. <laughs> <laughs> All so, yeah, just those are the rules. Just a few extra zeros to add there. Like the video, comment who has a better sweater. Yes. And you could win all of this. All of this <laughs> could be yours Not if this. you do that. <laughs> That's ours for now. This is my Christmas present. <laughs>